remember my Bruno fight. I went out there and it was so cold. They had to put a uh, blanket in the corner. And it took me a couple rounds. In as usual. Um, now he's boxing a little bit here. But Turbulent fight like a tornado. Comes el arms, elbows, everything's flying. He's now out, out of danger. Now he's got a little bit of a problem from the outside. He's trying to... And Porter, his last fight that was back in 2014. Oh, nice counter right hand by Porter. He found it. And there is a... a well, Ugas really isn't waiting. He's been walking hard. Went a couple of two, three rounds a few years ago. Well, lost two of those bouts. Ooh, ooh, pal, James there. Uh, again, it was a great left hook. And the NABF welterweight champ in 2010. Uh, Post-fight coverage over at FS1 after we're finished here. He, he looks like he's ready to see like that right there. And some good movement. Yeah. He's moving his, doing the oh, right things. But there's that great liver shot. By see that from the very start. But it looks like there's some blood on his lips, too. Yeah, that, that's what I can't make out. Inside is where... Oh, but judges and Marcus help me out. Don't they usually? But he's winning this round. Oh. A pro style, and he, he said he's seen every style. Busy once he got in there. He, to get in there. he needs to get a little bit closer. But that's what he's doing now. It, it would be better if he gets you this against the ropes and then a lot of combination shots. Left well, to the head of the right. right. Because right now, Ugas has really been concentrating on the body. And the body shot. The jab. Right there. See, there's his counter right hand. I think we're both right. Yeah, I think they both landed. But, but Ugas is given the corner with the line. Like, right there again. Look at that. He got the right hand. He's weaving the left. Oh. A little bold. And while, while Ugas was clowning around. It's... Ooh. Advantage for Ugas. Ooh. But... In his pro career, that was his last fight. Whereas Porter, very close fight. Yeah, it's not official, but Marco, stay with me. If you had the lean, even though okay, it's that. That's where he's better uh, active. Well, Sean Pine, this round he's done. That's, there's number four. That's so, because he's oh, trying to right play. landed. On he's trying head. to change. Porter landed right there. Maddox, we've seen from him the challenger known to do like that. Well, it's, it's, it's not preparing him as well because he doesn't know if he's going to come in or if he's going to go out. All right, so keeping him off. But whatever Porter thought he could create the mental edge against you, Josh, that we, we certainly haven't. Four rounds to go. That's it. That's it. A good counter left hook right hand by by Porter there. And he did it again. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> yep. The cold, cold weather's a and the fact of the matter is it's a it's it's a great right counter right hand right there. Now oh, I have Ugas up by a point. I gave Sean the last round, but it's extremely close body. Bring his hands down and try you know try to hurt what I was expecting. So oh great right, right, right hand by Porter right there. Yep. Yeah, that's your, Joe and a point. They should have 54. I mentioned the oldest chap, but that's a World Series winner went with the Cubs. But going at it. Oh, good right hand by Porter. Missed the hook because it was blocked. Ugas has Porter on the run. No, his, his dad wants a lot more from Porter than Porter. Oh, that was a given. That was a throwdown by yeah. Ugas. This isn't wrestling here. He's firing on you there. It should be the other way around. And that's that's the way. Come and throw some more shots. True. You're right there. They've got Porter tired. They think that the weight could be. They, they're thinking later rounds. You did touch on that in the beginning. Yeah, right? because well, what it does to you, it says, okay, you know, maybe a quick weight change. Strategies. Not the fact that he's tired or not tired. Yes, tried to push him back to get some punching. Oh, oh gosh, with a right. Oh, Porter. Oh, left. Oh, oh, Sean caught him. Two guys because of the work he did overall in the round and from my vantage point we try obviously with our cameras oh. as Porter oh. goes down he's gonna call it a slip and that's oh, is that what Jack Reese is saying oh, yes he, he, he's, he's, he, somebody he, needs to make a move now halfway through the fight this is where this is where you have to dig down deep that's a slip it was right there on the right corner his right. right foot there yeah it was a Uga's got buzzed by that jab yeah, and yeah. you can't get a minute to do it Lennox. he jumped in and he got countered by a right hand left hook they didn't land cleanly Gordon needs to make a feint and make him miss and then throw a punch after 
scheduled for 12. And it goes 12. The challenger from Cuba is it a dreamful of rounds of action. We have a split decision. Here are the score totals. And still, Kevin the BC welterweight champion of the world.